was it slipping back into the role of Ash after all these years? Easy. No, it's a pain in the butt. You got to stretch a little more now. Mm-hmm. Got to get ready. Got to get ready for ACT ION. You got to get your game face back on. That took a while. A lot of time in the pool. A lot of time on bicycles. Uh, so how does your character Kelly come into contact with Ash? You know, she's best friends with Pablo. He gets her this job at Value Stop. It's her first day, and she gets dragged into this. But once she's part of the team, she uh, she ends up having her own reasons to want to fight deadites. And ultimately, she brings common sense to the team, which which is great. For Ash. He teaches her how to fight. She teaches him how to think. How does your character come into contact with Ash? He works at the value stop with uh, Ash, and he's Ash's most loyal friend at the store. As a kid, you know, Pablo was told by his Latino uh, family that um, there's evil lurking in the world. And then he comes into contact with some evil, and he really believes that Ash is the one to save the world from evil. And together, he, Ash, and Kelly become this ultimate monster fighting squad. And, you know, they're, they're there to save the world from evil. Back when you were doing Army of Darkness no and Evil Dead, we know that uh, that no Sam liked to put you through a lot. Uh, does he still torture you on this? Well, Sam's older now, so it's harder for him to catch me. But, yes, he still torments me because he thinks the fans need that. It's an impulse that he has. It's hard to stop. He abuses all of us. We were all baptized and initiated by a bucket of blood and a paintbrush. I actually felt good about it in some weird way. There was, like, a blood splatter. Uh-huh. It's almost like an initiation, but he does it so aggressively. But you feel good about it because it's Sam Raimi. And he looks like it hurts me more than it hurts you, but it really hurts you. (laughs) It's so passive aggressive, but so awesome because it's Sam Raimi. I told him that that's what I wanted. Uh, I said I want to be covered in as much blood as possible, and I want to run through the wilderness of New Zealand completely naked, running from deadites. How did you keep Sam from totally damaging your star? I didn't. (laughs) There's no stopping Sam from doing anything. But in a good way, Sam set the tone for later in the series when other directors wanted to like throw blood on Bruce or like do crazy stuff to him it was like sorry like we kind of have to do this how are you I guess kind of like did you by any chance have a chance to be off camera throwing things at Bruce Campbell? No, but I do that in real life. Yeah. So I don't really need to be on a set. I'll just chuck things in. If he sits in front of me, you know, he's going to get popcorn about every three, four minutes right in the back of his head. He'll be kind of going like that. What's the best part about playing Ash? best part is that he is uh, not your standard hero. He doesn't have to do things right. He doesn't have to be polite. He doesn't have to give people their money back. You know, I mean, he doesn't have to do anything. But yet, he is our fearless leader, and we're going to follow him to the ends of the earth to defeat the evil. Awesome.